Christmas really means a lot to us. But you know, my favorite, one of the things I love about Christmas, I'm being honest here, are those classic Christmas movies on TV, like It's a Wonderful Life, Miracle on 34th Street. I know it's corny, but I just love it every year when those things roll around. And I gotta say, one of my all-time favorites is A Christmas Carol. I just love, 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 love it when that comes on TV every year. I especially love the part where Scrooge is visited by all the ghosts. I just think that's so cool, I never get sick of it. And I've always thought those scenes were pretty neat. And that got me thinking that there, I think there are three ghosts in that movie. There has gotta be some other ghosts out there. <laughs> ghosts that weren't in the original movie. And I thought we could maybe meet some of them tonight in a little segment we're gonna call Conan's Christmas Ghosts. Wouldn't that be fun? That's a little hat on. A little robe. Folks, for us, this is spending a lot of money, so play along, all right? I realize this is not... All right, isn't this great? I got my little bed here. Scooch bed, yeah. Oh, yeah, this is great. Got my little hat on. Guess some ghosts are gonna be coming by pretty soon. <laughs> Who are you? I am the ghost of Christmas sweaters. <laughs> it's, uh, it's nice to meet you. So, uh, what do you think of this sweater? It's okay. You, uh, think I could wear it after Christmas? <laughs> I wouldn't. You're probably right. Thanks. All right, bye-bye. Oh, hello, Conan. Wow, who, who are you? I am the Christmas ghost who's afraid of ghosts. So why are you here? I'm here to show you... Oh, a ghost! That was amazing. Uh, hello, Conan. I am the ghost of Christmas past. Come with me. Finally, this is gonna be great. This is terrific. Let's go. This is a real... Here we are. Oh my God, that's me. Actually, that's me. This is my past. I thought we were going to my past. Why would I do that? I don't even know you. Why, well, I just thought Hey, that... hey, get over yourself, man. <laughs> oh, look, there's my puppy, Dunstan. Hi, Dunstan. You want to see some Little League trophies? No, I'm getting the hell out of here. Uh, yeah, whatever, bye. <laughs> hey, yeah, come in. Ooh, hello, Conan. So, uh, who are you? I'm the ghost of Christmas shark attacks. <laughs> Why are you here? To tell you that sometimes on Christmas, some people decide to go swimming in the ocean. And although it's very rare, it's happened twice in the last 100 years, shark attacks do happen on Christmas. <laughs> what does that have to do with me? Oh, um... Just giving you a heads up, man. Um, actually, in case you have any plans to go swimming in the ocean for Christmas. Yeah, I'm not gonna go swimming. Oh, okay, uh, what are you doing? I'm gonna spend time with my family in Boston. Nice, yeah. nice. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're probably not even gonna go in the ocean at all then, huh? No. Okay, <laughs> right, right, wow. See you later. Okay, yeah, man, uh, yeah. Merry Christmas. Yeah, take okay. care. Yeah. Hi, Conan. Who are you? I am the ghost of a guy who died in the theater while watching the movie Ghost. Okay, that's, that's just terrible. That's awful. Yeah. So, uh, how did the movie ever end? Does uh, Demi Moore hook up with that bad guy, or does Patrick Swayze do something? Or? You know, I, I, I don't, it's been such a long time, I, I don't remember. Goldberg? No, I don't, I don't remember. No, I don't remember. 
What about Sleepless in Seattle? I think you should go. <laughs> Just go. Yeah. Colin. Uh, who are you? Just follow me, I'll show you. Oh, there. <laughs> Wait, who are you? I'm the ghost of Christmas who likes to have people watch me while I work out. <laughs> what do you think? What do I think of what? These guns. Yeah, they're, they're great. I'm going to head back. Thanks. So who are you? I am the ghost of Christmas recent past. The ghost of Christmas recent past. Yes, come with me. Remember this? What's up, dude? All right, we're going to take a little break. When we come back, Al Franken's going to be with us. Stick around. Howie, what's a good gift to get for somebody you really care about? Football tickets. No, no, no. Something you get more use out of. Season tickets. Something from the heart. Luxury suite. Oh, no! No, Howie, it's a free Nokia phone from Verizon Wireless. Just in time for the holidays, so it makes a great gift. And football tickets. Now at Radio Shack, get a free Nokia 5100 series phone after instant rebate. Plus, get 3,500 minutes for only $35 monthly access. Radio Shack. Just a sec. Hershey's pot of gold. What are you, crazy? We hardly know them. Bill? Hi. 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 Hershey's Pot of Gold. It's that good. This is Silverado Heavy Duty. The most powerful heavy duty pickup you can get. Silverado Heavy Duty. More truck from Chevy. Behold Gandalf the wizard. Behold Frodo the hobbit. Now they're not just to behold, they're to be held. Now at Burger King, buy a Whopper value meal and get a Lord of the Rings light-up glass goblet, just $1.99 each. Collect all four. The adventure begins here. The beauty, the world of Ralph Lauren, for the holidays, on polo.com, America Online Keyword Polo. Hello, I'm over here. Next only Rosie. <laughs> Wait, I'm here? It's funny, man. Yeah! Tim Allen. Something's burning. <laughs> then, do you know who's here for the first time? From Kate and Leopold, Breck and Meyer. And live music from my friend, Melissa Atrin. Plus, can you believe it's Monday again? Who's going to be our contestant for Makeover Monday? Find out next only Rosie. Monday at 3 on NBC5. Thank you, sir.